And I'm Tim Madison. And we're going to show you the physics behind horse jumping. This is Babe. She weighs a total of 498 kilograms, along with the weight of Rachel and the tack. The majority of the force landing goes to her cannon bone, pastern, and knee. In human language, this is considered to be her tibia and ankle. As a horse is cantering, it has a velocity of 3.648 meters per second, which translates to about 8 miles an hour. You can calculate this by taking the distance, which is 10.94 meters, and divided by the time, which is 3 seconds, before the horse makes the jump. As a horse leaps over this 3-foot jump, it forms a parabola. A parabola is an open, symmetrical plane shaped like an arch that follows a path of projectile under the influence of gravity. Horizontal velocity is 1.35 meters per second. The vertical velocity is also 1.35 meters per second. But to find the overall velocity of the horse's jump, you use Pythagorean theorem. A squared plus B squared equals C squared. In result, Babe has a total velocity of 3.648 meters per second. As the horse lands, it creates an impact. The force on the front legs as it lands is 35,000 newtons. Force is calculated by mass times acceleration. We wanted to see if the horse trots rather than canters will affect the force of impact on the horse's legs. In result, it did have an effect on the horse's legs because with a slower velocity, it requires more leg power rather than speed to match the height of the jump, thus landing with a greater force. To reduce the possible risk of injuries such as lameness or joint problems, you have to reduce the force on the horse's leg. To do this, you need the most cushioned arena footing. This will increase the time of landing. Since impulse is force times time, the longer the time landing, the less force on the horse's leg. Think about punching a pillow versus a wall. Your hand has more contact on the pillow longer than the wall, thus applying less force to your hand. Though a more cushioned arena will help this problem, it still requires more research to find the best solution. Thanks for watching! The physics behind horse jumping. Yeah, we'll be counting stars.